feel when when you're a murderer? I felt regretful because I felt regretful because I didn't I knew what I was doing was wrong, but I didn't stop myself. How did you feel being blinded? I felt like I could look back at my life. Why did you decide to baptize yourself? I wanted a fresh start. What did you do when you came back home? I decided to teach my colleagues the wonders of Jesus. Did, did you, why, did, why did you decide to baptise yourself? I wanted a fresh start. Do you try to encourage young Christians on their faithful way? Yes, of course. They are the next generation of apostles. What are the good qualities about an uh, apostle? Good public speaking. Justice, kindness in general, and good treatment of others. How did you feel when you were blinded by God? Well, I felt quite scared because I didn't know what was happening. How does it feel to be an apostle? It feels quite free and I felt quite happy because um, all my sins have probably washed away and God forgive me. How did you become an apostle? Well, I just, I was blinded and then someone um, blinded me so I don't really know what happened but I believed um, that God was real and I think I, I just changed into an apostle. How does it feel to have been called by God? It, I felt quite special because there are millions of people in the world and um, I was chosen to be called by God. How do you intend to live out God's mission? Well, I think that um, I'm going to say, um, speak about God to everyone and make everyone a Christian so they can believe God. How does it feel to be chosen to God? Well, it feels um, special and um, as I said, there, there are lots of people in the world and I felt quite special that I was chosen. How do you feel to tell everyone about the Son of God? Um, well, I feel um, quite special and I like how I tell everyone about God and they can tell families and the whole world will believe that God's real by the end of it. How does it feel to be close to God? Well, whenever I'm away from God, I feel like I'm close to God because he's always in my spirit and my heart. How did it feel when you got blind? It was weird since I could see about 10 seconds before, but then I couldn't. Did you know where you were going even though you were blind? It was hard, but I managed to get myself around. How did it feel to get baptised? It felt like I was finally a proper Christian and I believed in God. Why did you kill the people that believed in God? Well, I used to hate God, but now I've changed and I feel really bad. How did it feel to be someone you once tried to kill? I, f I felt heartbroken since I love God now and they were just doing the same thing. What good qualities make a good apostle? Qualities that make a good apostle is always believing in God and having hope. How did you feel when Jesus spoke to you? I felt like I needed to love God and make a change in my life for all the sins I've made. How did you intend to live out God's mission? I intend to live out God's mission by spreading the good news and caring for one another. What qualities make a good apostle? The qualities that make a good apostle are caring, loving and passion. What did it feel like to imprison people? To imprison people it made me to to imprison people it it made me feel proud and and um, made me release my anger. How did you why did you used to hate the followers and believers of God? I used to hate the followers and believers of God because I didn't I didn't believe that God was there. For you, what does it mean to be an apostle? 
to me to be an apostle to, to me to be an apostle to be a follower of God and to care and love for one another. How did you feel when you had your baptism? I felt blessed and felt like a new person. How did you feel when Jesus, when God came to you? I felt shocked and I didn't know who he was. What did it feel like being blind? It felt strange in a kind of way. How did you live out God's mission? By trying to uh, follow in his footsteps. What did what do you, did you feel like when you were when you was killing and threatening people? I felt bad, but I felt good in the same way. How did you feel when you were an apostle? I mean baptized. Felt free from sins. What qualities make you a good apostle? Following the footsteps and showing up the word of God. How, how did you how do you feel like feel that you're now free from sin? I'm great and happy and relieved. What do you feel when you're an apostle of God? Um I feel that I have a family behind my back. How did you feel when you were back? I felt like a whole new person and closer to God. What did it feel like when the when the light blinded you? I felt worried until I found out it was God. What did it feel like to imprison people? At the time it felt good, but now when I reflect on it, it seems bad. How did it feel to encounter God? It felt strange at first, but then I got used to God's callings. Who was Ananias? Ananias was a messenger and a follower of God. What does it mean to be an apostle of God? An apostle means to be a messenger of God and to follow in the footsteps of him. How did you feel when you saw the light? I felt confused but like a different person. Why did you make the Christians suffer? I didn't understand the people's love for God. Why did you change yourself when you were healed? Because I noticed the greatness and power of God. How did you feel when you were killing the followers of God? I felt quite guilty but I wanted these people to learn. What do you have to do to be a good apostle? You have to always believe God is with you no matter what. Could you have turned into a follower of God before you were blinded? No, because I didn't realise the Lord's selflessness. <laughs> How did you feel being baptised? I felt like a new person. I felt like I had the life of God. Three, two, one, go. What risks do you take when you're an apostle? Um, I took risks of people trying to hurt me and, and possibly kill me. And also, when people did believe in Jesus, when I didn't, they just hated how I believed. Why did you threaten to put Christians in prison and, and threaten to kill them? Um, I did that because I thought that I was a god, and that I was good in doing that. But then I didn't realise how important God was to Christians, and I feel really bad about bad about what I did to them people. How did you change to a Christian form locking up them? Um, I changed because I really focused on how my my mind wanted to like believe in Jesus, in God, and the Holy Spirit. Inside, did you feel like you were doing the right thing or the wrong thing? Inside, when I was um, locking up these um, Christians, I thought that I was doing the right thing because I didn't believe in God um, and I thought they were just it was just a waste of time to um, pray to God and Jesus. Why didn't you like Christians before you got the message from God? I didn't like them because um, again they were it, I thought it was just like a waste of time to believe in that stuff and um, just silly to believe in 
the Holy Spirit and how it and you can change. Could you have time to follow up of Jesus for he reminded you? Um, I don't think so. Um, I don't think I could have changed because, again, I thought it was silly to believe in God and I just thought that I could never change my mind. Why did you change your name from Saul to Paul? Um, I changed it because I wanted a new start and I, I just wanted a fresh start um, because I did so many bad sins. Why did you lock up the Christians in the first place? Um, I did that because I just thought that they were silly to believe in God and Jesus and I didn't know what he could do and why he did it.